Hey everyone, this is Chris here and today I wanted to make a kind of like a special video to talk about a subject that recently came up on the Talk Tennis Forum. Uh, there was a forum member on that website that had uh, basically said that they were having some trouble with a teaching pro that's been kind of taking over the local courts near where they live and they've been having a problem with getting access to these courts and uh, what to do about it, how you should handle that situation. I thought this would make for a really interesting video, so we're going to go ahead and cover that subject in this particular episode. Now, if you guys are new to this channel, then I'd like to encourage you to please take a minute to hit the subscribe button down below. That'll keep you notified of any time we release additional content like this. And of course, if you enjoy videos like this, then please be sure to share this video with your friends. All right, guys, without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and get into the subject right now. So the forum user's name is Power Backhand, and Power Backhand uh, writes, An annoying thing happened last month. There are two public courts within walking distance of my house where I've been playing with my kids and friends for the past year and a half. A month ago, I went there with my kids on a Saturday morning, and out of the blue, there was a teaching pro there. He gave one lesson and then left. I didn't mind at first, he seemed to only be there for a couple of hours on Saturday morning after three weeks had passed and he has expanded his operation. He is uh, now there from 8 to 12.30 on Saturday and Sundays and he seems to continue extending uh, his client base. The past two weekends I went there with my kids in the morning and could not play. What would you do in this situation? So power backhand, excellent question. Um, Here's what I would do in this particular situation. Um, some of you guys know this, but I, I used to be a teaching pro, a tennis instructor, and I uh, taught tennis uh, through a school program for about five years. So I've actually been in this type of situation a lot of times as the pro, believe it or not. And uh, the one thing I would really do is, if you can, is just to try to work with the instructor because for the most part, people in our industry really try to make it easy on rec players. I mean, you have to share the courts with them. That's always a challenge. Um, you have to work around the school schedule as well, and that's always a challenge also. So it's really beneficial, if you can, to build bridges and not try to make things harder for people, I've always found. Um, one of the things that I would always do if I knew there was a group of people that would like to meet, let's say, on Tuesdays, is I'd let them know what our lesson schedule was ahead of time so that if they wanted to have their matches on Tuesdays they would at least know we're gonna be there from let's say you know 4 30 to 8 o'clock every Tuesday for the next six weeks and that's a good thing to do for the pro that kind of keeps everybody on the same page makes it a whole lot simpler and easier for everybody and it's just a good idea in general to help people when you can in this uh, industry because tennis is a really really small group of people if you think about it I mean we don't have the same number of people playing tennis that we do football and uh, baseball and basketball at least not in the US so I always encourage people if you get the chance just work with the person I mean it'll probably come back to help you at some point down the road and that's really the advice that I would give uh, just try to find out what the schedule is for that teaching pro and see if you can kind of meet him in the middle somewhere. Hopefully that answer helps. Please leave me a comment down below and let me know what you guys think of this video and what you would do in this particular situation. Thank you so much for watching guys. I will see you at the next one.